Hey everyone, Dale here with Pacific Sun Technologies. I hope you all have been doing pretty well and enjoying the content that we put out there. We've been pretty busy here the last couple weeks thanks to all of you that support the channel and have gone solar with us thanks to our videos. I haven't posted any new videos recently in the coming weeks because, or in the past weeks because sadly there really hasn't been anything all that new or exciting to talk about until today. Enphase just rolled out a price drop on their entire battery backup lineup. We're talking the NPower Smart Switch got a reduction in price and the NCharge 3 and 10 batteries. And I'm super excited to show you the difference in pricing before this change has taken effect and what you can expect to see now with this new pricing. And let me tell you, it is awesome. Now, for those of you that aren't familiar with Enphase and their in-charge batteries, don't worry. I'll be providing a brief summary of their equipment and how it works. But you can also check out one of our previous videos on this equipment, just so that way you can get more in-depth details. It really hasn't changed too much since that video. But before I do, please take a second to subscribe to our channel by clicking that button down below. And for those of you that are interested in going solar or adding battery backup to your existing Enphase system, then visit us online to receive a hassle-free quote. I've included a link in the description below. All right. So Enphase rolled out their newest generation of batteries last year. The entire system is dubbed Ensemble, if you're not familiar with that. And the Ensemble system includes Enphase microinverters, of course, their IQ combiner box, specifically their cellular model, the NPower 200 amp smart switch, that's basically an auto transfer switch, and the NCharge batteries themselves. Now they have an NCharge 3 and they have an NCharge 10. The NCharge 10 is three NCharge 3 batteries connected together. Pretty straightforward. Now when all of these products are combined, you have a kick-ass battery backup solution called Ensemble. But one thing that has been holding back Enphase in the market, or at least taking on market share from other competitors, is the cost of their batteries, and specifically their NCharge 10 batteries. Enphase's biggest competitor is SolarEdge with their Energy Hub solution paired with LG Chem Battery. I did a video on that, so be sure to check that one out if you wanna learn more about it. And let's not forget about Tesla because they're ever so popular Powerwall. I don't think it's a coincidence that Enphase reduced their prices this week when Tesla has recently been increasing their prices across the board for their solar roofs, solar panels, and their power wall. In fact, they've been increasing their price so much so, it's not just on new customers, they've actually been going back to existing customers that have been in contract for several months. This whole Tesla situation is really for another video, so be sure to subscribe to the channel. And while you're down there, I'm gonna include some links below, just so that way, if you're interested in learning about these price increases Tesla has been doing, you can learn more about them. But there is plenty of news outlets covering this um, recent development. But let's get back to Enphase, because that's really what this video is about and why you, you know, hit that play button and their new prices and how they're going to benefit you if you're gonna get battery backup. So I wanna start off with a system price today before these decreases actually took effect. And I think it's pretty valuable because then you get to see how much money you're saving now that you can get in charge at a, at a very affordable price in my opinion. It, it really puts them in line with Tesla and SolarEdge. I'm going to design this system using Qcell's Peak Duo Black ML-G9 Plus 380 watt module. This is a phenomenal panel. It's brand new, made here in the United States, or at least assembled. I'm going to design this around 21 panels for the solar system. That's roughly an eight kilowatt. Enphase Ensemble systems allow for up to four 10 kilowatt hour batteries be connected together. So you could have up to 40 
kilowatt hours, that's four in charge, 10 batteries. So I'm going to start with one and scale it to the maximum of four batteries because unlike some of these other systems, now Tesla, the Powerwall, you can keep adding Powerwalls, but for SolarEdge, you really at this time can only put one LG Chem RESU 16H prime battery, that's it. Or if you did their RESU 10H battery, you could do two of those, but why would you when that's 18 kilowatt hours or 19 kilowatt hours versus the 16? I get you get a little more, but it's marginal. Now what's nice, like I said, with Enphase system is you can scale it over time. So you could start with just this one N charge 10 battery and grow it slowly at you know, an affordable price. And heck, maybe they keep reducing the prices over the next couple years to get to a point where you do, you started off with one N charge 10 and you know, over the course of the next five years, you have all four. So that's a lot of backup power. Let me tell you, 40 kilowatt hours, each battery I think puts out roughly, it surges 25 amps. So that's a hundred amp surge. I think it's 16 amps continuous. So that's 64 amps continuous. And that's without factoring in the solar system. Enphase systems do allow you to really operate 100% off the solar system during a power outage, even if the battery is 100% full. No other systems besides SolarEdge do that. So Tesla, the Powerwall shuts the solar system off during a backup situation if the battery is 100% full. Um, solar Edge, they're able to stop the power flowing and throttle with the optimizers. So keep that in mind. Now the pricing I show in this video is for a turnkey solution and does not include any promotional discounts that we may have going on. So with that said, if you want the most accurate price, you're going to need to get a quote from us. Sorry, that's the best way to go about it. But guess what we make it really easy and we're not a hard sale kind of company so using that link down below you have submit your information and we'll get a price over to you that includes any promotions we have going on so here's the current ensemble system pricing as you can see this is not a cheap system by any means coming in at forty six thousand five hundred and ten dollars before the federal investment tax credit which puts us at $34,400 roughly. And that was just for one N charge 10 battery. This price is only going to increase as we add more batteries, of course. So let's continue. Two N charge 10 batteries increases the price to $61,341 before that federal tax credit of 26%, making it $45,400 roughly after the tax credit. Three N charge 10 batteries, the price is now $76,173 before that tax credit and $56,368 after. Now, if you max it all out all at once, you're looking at four N charge 10 batteries, which increases that price to $91,000 before the tax credit and roughly $67,343 after. This has made it very difficult for any consumer, whether you're looking to go solar now with a brand new system, or you already have N-phase microinverters and you wanted to add the N-charge 10 batteries for backup, it's really been expensive. So a lot of people have been like, eh, about it. But with this new pricing that I'm gonna show you, you're gonna see a drop about 20%, well not 20%, of $20,000 before any promotions starting with one N charge 10 battery. We are now looking at $41,930 before the federal investment tax credit and 31,000 after. As we increase the batteries, pricing of course increases, but now it's an increase more in line with say a Tesla Powerwall. Two N charge 10 batteries puts us at $53,496 before the tax credit and 39,587 after. Three N charge 10 batteries puts us at 65,000, a little over, before that tax credit, and around $48,150 after. And finally, a fully maxed out system with four N charge 10 batteries, you would expect to pay $76,630 roughly before that tax credit or $56,705 after. That right there just before you factor in the tax credit we're talking a fifteen thousand dollar price drop across the system that is 
incredible for Enphase to be able to do that. And it's only going to get more affordable as more people start to buy into their solutions because they're going to be able to increase their manufacturing capabilities. So, you know, you might be paying a little more right now. If you're one of the first people that got an end charge, you definitely paid a premium in the beginning. But thank you for your support because you helped Enphase reduce their prices for more customers. So if you have one end charge 10 battery, maybe now you want to start thinking about adding a second one or a third one because now it's even more affordable than before. I think this change in pricing is vital for Enphase and really will help them increase their market share against their competitors because they honestly offer a really awesome bulletproof solution when you look at the ensemble package. I mean, their microinverters come with a 25 year warranty. Tesla's inverter comes with a 12 and a half year warranty and you don't get any module level optimization or module level monitoring. As for SolarEdge, sure, optimizers come with a 25 year warranty, but the standard warranty on their inverter, the Energy Hub, is only 12 years. Yes, it can be extended to 25 years, but it's not standard, whereas in phase it is. As for the batteries, the warranty is pretty equal across the board, but what Enphase offers in regards to their battery technology is lithium iron phosphate, LFP. And if you haven't watched some of my other videos, then you may want to know that LFP is one of the most stable and safest and most reliable. I mean, I could go most and most over and over with an LFP battery, but it honestly is one of the best technologies out there. It does cost a bit more than lithium ion that the LG Chem battery uses and the Tesla Powerwall. LFP, you could literally like drill a hole into it while it's doing something and nothing will happen. You're not gonna have an explosion, you're not gonna have anything. I'm not saying that would happen with lithium ion, but it's a really safe battery, really, really safe. So the Ensemble solution is finally a system I think our customers, you, are going to be excited to actually buy. And for those of you that already have Enphase microinverters but have been holding off on adding Enphase battery backup because of the freaking cost, well, guess what? You can finally get battery backup at an affordable price with your Enphase solution. You don't have to, you know, retrofit a Tesla Powerwall or another type of battery backup solution. You can actually have a full Enphase battery backup system that all works in one monitoring platform. Now, I've provided a link for you in the description below so that way you can request a free quote for either a new system, you know, solar and batteries, or if you just wanna add battery backup, we're here to help you. Well, that's it for this week's video. Let me know uh, what you think of the price change and if you're someone that's you know going to consider Ensemble now, thanks to these new prices. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Yeah, hit that button down below and subscribe to our channel. I have plenty of new content coming about. I, I'm really thinking about maybe putting this system against a SolarEdge Energy Hub now that the pricing is more in line. In fact, just to give you an idea, it's actually a little bit better than the Solar Edge Energy Hub with an LG Chem battery. Well, thanks again for watching. Until next time.